Hello, uh, my name is Bill Lupton. Thank you for joining me in this watercolour demonstration. It is just a bit of fun really. I'm just going to throw paint on as quick as I can to create as much drama as possible in as short a period as possible. Uh, why not leave some comments and let me know what you think. Thank you. I did paint the painting quite quickly but uh, the playback is actually twice normal speed. Um, and here I go just throwing some blue in from the top right hand corner. I just want some light in this top right hand corner. I will add some darks down the left soon. I've got an idea that I want this to be quite a dramatic flat stormy landscape. I've just added some warm in there for the time being. Just let that run into that blue. Well here we go with the dark colours down this left hand side. You'll see that I'm gradually going to darken this. Um, down towards the horizon and maybe add a few more lines in there. All these colours are sort of the same direction so it looks like it's quite stormy blowing from that right hand side. If you like my style of painting why not check out my website www.thepaintings.co.uk you might find something of interest. There's some kits and also immediate downloadable painting guides there. Okay so now I want to start getting down towards the horizon. I've put a nice line of water in there which keeps that area nice and bright. But what I do want to do is put some more dark in the sky, so here we go. This is now mixing Payne's Grey with the blue, so I get a real dark colour. Well, I then mixed some of the blue with uh, Lizard and Crimson to give me a nice mauve, and I just fancied looking like some distant hills there, so I'll drop those in now, and then I'll start adding some warm colours as I come forward in the foreground. I'm going to try and leave quite a few little white areas as you can see just to highlight uh, one or two places. So here we go, as I come forward I'm getting stronger and darker colour. And now it's time for some real dark paint. This is Payne's Grey Whip mixed with the blue to give me a real dark blue colour. And I will strengthen this as I come further forward and maybe use some tissue just to soften a few areas off later. I'm just using a tissue just to pull that water that I've just put on down into that area there. It'll give me a nice dish in the path and lead me nicely into the painting. I'll then put some very dark paint on there each side just to make it look more like a bank uh, of land and then pull that down as well. This gives me a nice foreground. As you can see I'm making use of those dark areas by putting some grass on the top and then running a boundary fence down into the distance. Just balancing up that fence from the right hand side with something similar on the left hand side and then I shall put something underneath that fence just to darken that bank a little bit in a similar way so it does balance the painting a little bit more. Now it's almost finished, pop in their sky, three birds, one, two, three and there we are, finished. Well that's a very quick and dramatic painting, I don't think I've painted one quicker for a long time. Um, please don't forget to subscribe, then you'll receive free notifications whenever I do upload any new videos. Um, and hopefully we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.